the Ultimo Stile experience about classic Italian sports cars. I try to inspire people to see how simple it is to do all the exciting stuff. So go ahead, make your day. In the very last minute, I decided to go with some Copenhagen classic car community friends to the Nürburgring last weekend. The main purpose was to watch the annual Old Timer Grand Prix, organized by the German Automobile Club, AVD. It was three days packed with races, but I had to go and drive the North Loop at least a handful of laps. It did not work out well. I forgot my sunglasses, I didn't raise the tire pressure, and I forgot to adjust my mirrors. Not a good thing in an old, slow car like mine. And on top of everything, I forgot the cable that plugs in my iPhone for Harry's lap timer. It was all bloody well terrible. Here's a lapse of overtakings and other struggles for you to enjoy. back towards the barriers, I took another lap, but more about that in the next video. The OGP is all about wonderful cars and generous owners who also seem to love showing their cars off. The whole GP arena is buzzing with cars of all old ages, zooming to and from races. My dream is of course to take part in the races. And I must admit that uh, this plan is taking some time. But I'm almost there. I promise to be here next year. Driving to and fro, obviously. The new book thing was originally built as two large loops in the Eiffel Hills, north and south, 23 kilometers and 8 kilometers respectively. The Südschleife is gone and only the original layout of the Nordschleife exists today. The most original remaining structure is the old paddock, Altes Fahrerlager, a place I have been contemplating for a photo shoot for some time. There's even numbers on the garages. I got a discount on entry and parking with the German Alpha Club. I took the whole package, not remembering that it included party and dinner and stuff. Morgen. The 
Germans have it all organized very well indeed, as you would probably expect. But it doesn't ruin anything. On the contrary, everything is quite streamlined and it was easy to go in and out everywhere. The German Alpha Club has the Scuderia del Portello in the middle of everything. The old factory team came up from Milano and took part in many races with some wonderful cars. All were very noisy, as it should be. Friday afternoon, they run the 400 km marathon for pre-1976 or something cars, and it's in the North Loop. They start in two groups, and it is my favorite. It lasts four full hours.
But on the new GP track, they also run uninterrupted with all kinds of classes, ranging from pre-war over 60s gentleman GTs and 1950s F1 cars to modernish BMW M1 and Porsche 935 Le Mans racers. Wonderful and genuinely overwhelming. So, I snuck into the old paddock, and I think I fit it in just right. Nobody seemed to mind. Saturday was a pre-1961 sports car and GT race, run over two hours into the dark of evening. They had all the exceptional marks running, from big bangers and howling racers, to small GT cars like Giulietta and its competition from back then, the Lotus Elise and the Porsche 356. 